guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Dana. This is a brand new channel focusing exclusively on cloth napping. With the virus spreading, COVID-19, spreading the globe, it's putting a huge demand on cloth nap uh, on disposables, which make is making them very unavailable to a lot of people. So a lot of people are now switching over to cloth, even on my child. He's <laughs> looking at himself in the mirror. So today I'm going to be showing you guys four of the most commonly used type of cloth nappies there are out there. So, sorry, I need to do that. <laughs> there are so many different other designs and styles out there, but I only, I'm, I'm only going to focus on the top four. Obviously, you can do your research and have a look out there and see what else you can look at or buy, but I'm going to be focusing on the ones that are the most readily available. Now, the most readily available one that you can pretty much find anywhere as soon as you type in modern cloth nappies is this. It is pretty much the exact same as a disposable, except it comes with its top layer of micro fleece, which is stay dry, which means when baby wets, it goes straight through and this feels dry to the touch. This is your waterproofing layer. It has some PUL, can't really tell, but it's like plastic coated. See the light, how it's shiny? It's plastic coated, which makes it waterproof. And then you just put your inserts of choice in there. And there is a variety of different inserts, which I'll focus on in another video focusing on just pockets on its own. But if you're, so if you're interested in pockets and this looks good to you, follow that video that's coming up next. But yeah, that's pockets. They're the most commonly available because they're the most like disposables. The next option is a snap and wipe system. Their Bear and Boho did that huge release. This is actually a Bear and Boho Aldi release that everyone went nuts for a couple months ago. But Yes, these are readily available as well online. Just Google Bear and Boho. There's other brands out there like Alchemina that have them in the 3.5s. Again, I'll do another video on these separately and exclusively. But basically, it's got no straight stay dry liner on it. It's just the plastic PUL backing, so it's completely waterproof. And it's not really sticky at all, except, I don't know. <laughs> but basically, it comes with snaps. As you can see, the inserts snap in. And they're really handy for those who have just like a heavy wetter and doesn't poo really often. Like my bob, I only get like one out of him a day. But you would just take out a soiled wet insert, snap it out, then you get a fresh one. This is the same one. But you just get it out, you wipe this out, pop your new insert in and away you go. So you can reuse the shell, you just need to carry a bunch of new inserts. Which is really handy if you just want to be really like minimal with your nappy bag you just want to take like the bare minimum take maybe two shells three shells whatever you could just sort of water them up and a bunch of inserts and then just take your wet bag the next most available one is an all-in-one now they are pretty similar to a pocket in a way in type of in style of make they have the micro fleece usually with the design p well on the back except their inserts are sewn on usually at the back but sometimes you get some with one sewn at the back one sewn in at the front and you overlap them some sewn in at the front but that's really rare but nine times out of ten they're sewn in at the back and they usually come so imagine it's stuck together like that you would hang them like that in the wash because they're stuck together sometimes you get them with a big snake insert like this and you just fold them up and pop them on bob like that directly sometimes they come with a where is it there a one insert like this, it's simple, but usually they come with this, which is usually three layers, um, then you fold it up so it makes six layers of absorbency, whereas this usually comes in a five, and it's much longer, takes longer to dry. So with these ones, you need a lot of nappies because you can't just quickly swap out an insert or have a bunch of other inserts that you can just, because shells dry much faster than, but yeah, so if you just want something that you can't lose an insert with, good option, because these are sewn together, I'll just hide that around. <laughs> These are sewn together and you can't, you know, lose them. That's how they are. So that's the last. And then the last option is ye old fashioned flats. You know, flats come in a variety of fabrics. You can use swaddles from the Baby Island, Kmart or Target or Big W. I'll do another video and reviews on all of those later. But the most common one is Terry. You would have seen, well, hang on, prior to 30 years ago, this is the standard for nappies. And then prior to Terry coming out, then just cotton was the standard. This is what babies have been clothed in since the dawn of time, pretty much. Just not exactly Terry. 
but yes you can use any type of fabric you can get your hands on and they're pretty versatile because you can cloth in fat flats from birth and all the way up and you can you really only need to buy maybe two different types of fabrics muslin for a newborn and then terry for you know for about five months older i mean five months up so with that that's probably the most commonly found types of nappies on the market there are probably other types on the market but i either don't know about them or they're a slight variation of something that i've already showed you so i'm now going to go on and do um, a pocket deep in-depth pocket video so hopefully i helped you at least pick something that might work for your family um so yeah i hope that helped a little bit so see you in the next video bye